All right, what we have here is black cod, and uh, I put a seasoning, mango, date, and the ground it up in the blender, a little bit of that. And I put it on there with some uh, salt and pepper and uh, cayenne. And now I'm cooking it up, and we're gonna try it on a sandwich in a little bit. Pretty epic. America. American grilling. You can hear the American uh, eagle screaming in the background. Take no substitutes for American grilling. Hey, look, it's actually over there. Right, look behind you. Right there. So it is, so it is. I told you, it's American freedom. It wants some fish. Yeah, it smells it, I guess. I'll give it a piece of fish. If it can... Damn. Tastes smells like American freedom. Dude. I'll have to leave a piece of it out here for it. So succulent. about done. Sure been frying the fryer a lot. You see it turns all from white into sort of like golden caramel brown. And then it's done. Oh, oh, I'm losing it. Oh. It's getting real soft. It's getting real soft. Yeah, it's, it's done. So bam, check this out. I cooked it just right. Watch, it peels right off and it's all brown. Look at that. Mm. Mr. Brown is out of town, you know what I mean? So then we'll set it on there, you know, get it divided up. The point is here, we're using the rye bread from Winco, whole wheat, you know. You got your authentic brown mustard, your basil. It's just a standard sandwich, you know, onions, lettuce, tomatoes. Mm, you know, that's about it. Uh, if you can get it, some artichoke talks without artichoke hearts without salt it's hard to say okay um it's gonna be a delicious meal that's all i know hmm. it's so much better than i thought it would be and like it's so good with these salt and vinegar potato chips it's just delicious mm. <clears throat> it's the best pretty good